So, may gabi day mga kalaag, no, today's update na to mga kalaag. So, nagpagawas na, o executive order, ang, ang atong bago nga presidente, executive number 3, nga pwede na tadili mag ma sa outdoors, outdoors only mga kalaag, no. So, What? voluntary na lang ang atong pag mas pwede na ito mag mas pwede po tadili sa outdoors only mga kalaag. For sure ko, daghan kay pabor ani mga kalaag, no, kay makita na nila atong mga tsura o so, mga mag-uyab dahil ni mga kalaag no, daghan siguro magbulag ni mga kalaag kaya makita na nilang naong sa ilang mga uyab kaya karong panahon na mga kalaag daghan kay gwapag-gwapo sa pananaw sa oban tungod sa pismas so dako kayong tabang sa pismas <laughs> kaya yung panahon na pero karon yan pagawas ng executive order number 3 ang atong presidente nga pwede na tabi ni mag sa outdoors daghan naging magbulag ni mga kalaag no char lang Pero wani mga kalaag no, ang ipagawas ng order number 3 sa atong presidente. What's this? Uh, naglabas po tayo today ng executive order number 3. Allowing voluntary wearing of face masks in outdoor settings and reiterating the continued implementation of minimum public health standards during the state of public health emergency relating to the COVID-19 pandemic. So ito na po yung ina-announce ng DOH ng voluntary wearing of face masks outdoors in non-crowded places uh, provided kung kayo ay immunocompromised, seniors or hindi kumpleto ang bakuna, kailangan pa rin po mag-face mask or strongly encourage ang face masks. Okay? Basahin ko na lang po precisely yung provision. The voluntary wearing of face masks in open spaces and non-crowded outdoor areas with good ventilation is hereby allowed provided that not fully vaccinated individuals, senior citizens, and immunocompromised individuals are highly encouraged to wear their masks and physical distancing will be observed at all times. So, meron pa rin tayong physical uh, distancing. Face masks shall continue to be worn in indoor, private, or public establishments, including in public transportation, by land, air, or sea, and in outdoor settings where physical distancing cannot be maintained. Tuloy pa rin po ang other minimum public health standards intended to effectively prevent and minimize the spread of COVID-19 in the country. It shall continue to be implemented consistent with the principles of shared accountability, evidence-based decision-making, socio-economic equity, and rights-based approach. In this regard, the DOH is directed to update the MPHS guidelines with the issuance of this order. Okay. In addition to that, um, we're happy to announce that we are 6% away from the wall of immunity. That's why we're malakas na loob natin for face masks. Now, congruent to that as well, the state of calamity is extended for possibly three months, but only for the purpose of preserving the, the benefits under it, such as, but not limited to, the indemnification, the, hold on, para mas precise tayo. Okay, here we go. Indemnification, emergency procurement, uh, special risk allowance for healthcare workers. We will transition out of the state of calamity uh, after further review. So sa mga nagtanaw karon sa atong vlog mga kalaag no daghan king salamat unta i-follow ninyo atong page share then comment mga kalaag no para mo daghan pa atong mga followers o kana ra mga kalaag bag-o update sa atong face mask daghan salamat